this is the uh, the bed I've made for the sawmill. Uh, it's made out of six by six uh, pressure treated timbers. Um, <coughs> I got pressure treated because of course it's on the ground. It's going to be outside and unprotected. Um, it is 27 feet long, which is a little bit longer than needed, but um, there was no reason really to cut it shorter. It's I've made it from 10 foot, 10 foot, and 8 foot 6 by 6s um, minus 6 inches at each lap joint. So there's a lap joint. Right there, another lap joint over there, and two more there and there. Um, I have I drilled half-inch holes and pinned the joints together and pinned them to the sleepers with uh, pieces of rebar that I just cut with a hacksaw. Um, yeah, I'll probably fill more gravel in here or some other you know well-drained soil to keep it dry and keep it from freezing and shifting too much um, and this is the whole area obviously I'm gonna have to this is the area where I'll be walking back and forth with the sawmill so I'm gonna need to smooth this out level this out um, but first things first next is to start assembling the sawmill <laughs> 